Have you ever had trouble joining friends in a party or in private chat? What about joining people in a multiplayer match? If you have, there's a chance that your router's NAT settings are the root of the problem. Now, NAT stands for Network Address Translation, and to paraphrase a whole lot of techno babble, it helps your router manage several devices using a single IP address. Don't worry about all that though. What you need to know is that your NAT settings should be set to open. You can check your NAT status by heading to System Settings, choosing Network Settings, and running Test Xbox Live Connection. If your NAT is set to moderate, this means you will not be able to connect with people who have strict NAT settings. If your NAT is strict, you cannot connect with players who have moderate or strict settings. You'll receive an error message like so if your NAT settings are moderate or strict. All right, now we know why you can't connect to certain people and really that's the important point. How do we solve this? Well, each router is a little different, but here are a couple suggested solutions. One, if your router includes a universal plug and play option, make sure that's enabled. Two, you can always connect your Xbox 360 directly to your broadband modem, bypassing the router altogether. If you do need to configure your NAT settings manually, make sure you consult your router's manual. For more details and helpful tips, you can also go to xbox.com slash network help. Now we'd like to take a moment to thank you for sending the hundreds of show ideas to Xbox 101. Please keep them coming. And if you have a show idea, email us at askix at xbox.com. Thanks for watching Inside Xbox.